Greetings. You know what I, you know where we are. You know what we're doing. You know. You know. All of you know. That wasn't a distraction to get my timer going. Anyways. Last we left off, we met Veronica, and now we basically got insulted. Uh, now if you'll excuse me, I gotta turn this volume down a little bit. This is a very loud game. Volume settings. There. That way I can still hear, I can still enjoy the music, but still. Oh yeah, that's right, that glow. Alright, um... Flea in her ear. She means to return. This time she has companions. Perhaps it will work. You know, how much money do I have? You know what? We're gonna do something real quick. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. I'm gonna do something real quick. Hold on. First off, I might have to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, There's a deer shot right there. I'm gonna do this so that my friend can understand what I mean, what they, what their biggest staple is of the puff puff joke. I'm just gonna sell something. Um, what do I have? On, ah, there we go. We have, I have a plethora of cotton tops. So there. Now let's head over to the bathhouse. Watch, knowing my luck, since I didn't do it on the one free time, I'm going to have to spend like 200 gold just to go in here. Oh, it's just completely free. Nice. Alright. Now, we're going to see what the hell this is about. Let's hope I'm accurate and that they keep the joke the same. If not, then... Oh well, it's gonna be a new experience for me. All right, um, not you. Her, there we go. Thou art surpassing fair of face. Wilt thou sample the essential puff puff for a mere twenty gold coins? Sure. <laughs> Well, art thou not alive with pleasure? <laughs> the fucking <laughs> Was that it? <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe that's an actual fucking thing. I'm a little disappointed it didn't exactly like show what I've been telling him it is, but still. The concept remains though, your imagination is enough to make it funny as hell. And the funny thing is, there's like multiple forms of it, which is much more than like any of the other games, so... This dude's gotta have mad importance if they're willing to give him like multiple forms of puff puff throughout the game. Of course, look at this big fucking sword the dude's got on his back. Alright, now... Our next goal, um... Alright, what was it that this dude wanted? I needed to get iron ore, and I needed to create a gold ring of one quality or more. That, and I also need to find this little girl's dad. Which is probably, uh, which I also need to go into the bar there, so. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to get this dude a ring, and then I'm probably gonna try to see if I can find an iron ore, which I highly doubt I can do that right now. I would love it if you could just pull out the damn forge at any moment's notice and just be like, okay, I've got to work on it. What the hell? Alright, it's just there. Um, i got to go way the hell over to get that done, but you know what? I'm going to go get it done. Not worried about y'all. Not worried about y'all. I'll fight y'all on the way back. Right now, I'm just gonna run right to the nearest camp and try to forge. Who knows? I might even get some perfection of uh, pearls, so that way I can actually upgrade my claymore. Ah, lump mages.
There it is. Yes. Let's make a campfire here. Hey, I can level it up. Nice. Let's level up. Do -do 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 -do. They keep the jingles the same. Double edged bash? It's a strong simultaneous strike over two squares, one above the other. Oh. Rings, gold ring, yes. We gotta make this of at least plus one quality or more. Holy shit. It's a praise. I need it to be a plus one quality or more. I don't give a shit about anything else. Plus one quality or more. Yes, exactly plus one. Alright, rework an item. I need four for that shit. All right, well, what about you? Um, four for everything. Shit. Okay. Shit. Shit poo-poo. The poo-poo over the crap. Um. What the hell with it? Let's just, let's try to make Eric's dagger better. Why not? Let's try the flourish as well. Flourishes, double edge bash. Well. Alright, appraise. Turn out really well. I don't feel brave enough to try that bottom one again. Eric's dagger plus two. Let's see how much damage that does. Like, is it actually better than his current dagger? No, but it does raise his deafness quite a bit. Anyways. Um. Yeah. Let's rest until. So I woke up not too long ago myself. Let's rest until dawn. Then we're going to start heading back to the town, give the guy the ring, and then we're going to try to continue the story because we got to head over the bar. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. That ain't going to work. Uh, I'm a moron. All right, well, let's go across. Some hot-ass water, dude. All right. What the hell is that? Oh, is that my iron ore? Hold on. Hold on. If I could get both these quests done in one go, that'd be great. Copper ore. Iron ore. There we go. Yep. There's my iron ore. Now I can get iron arms. Now we're gonna fight you. Pow! Ten preemptive damage. Nice. Pongo Drongo, huh? Or Bongo Drongo? I thought it was Pongo Drongo. I like that, that Claymore, dude. That thing looks nice. All right, let's try Persicutter. Dude! 86 damage? Wow! Damn, Eric. You a nasty some You a nasty somebody with that ability. Straight up. That is a great synergy. Take a sip of my water real quick. All right, speaking of which, what is the difference between the two here? 
Okay, focus on fighting, leaving the camera and characters to their own devices. Control the character in, ca in camera and characters as you see fit. Okay. So it's just straight up like, okay, do you want to make it look dynamic at its own right, or do you want to trust the game to make it look dynamic? I'm going to play with the with the fancy schmancy mode. <laughs> Alright, now what I got to do is I got to take this ring to the one dude, so unfortunately I got to go through the bar for this. Welcome to our inn. A safe haven in life's storm. Come and make merry. <laughs> Warnings unheeded. The fish returns to the tree. <laughs> what can deter? She's with us. Do you have a problem with that? Understanding doors. The fish has a chaperone. She is uh, welcome here. Good. Can you actually buy beer here? <laughs> She's a little bit. No one's sitting here, are they? Service, if you please. A fearsome young pup. Perhaps tea will soften her. A fine, warm brew. Very accurate. That sounds lovely. But I don't have time for tea, I'm afraid. I'm looking for someone. I'll get straight to the point. There's a girl called Serena. Blonde hair, looks a lot like me. Have you seen her? <laughs> Blonde hair looks a lot like you. <laughs> Uh, I don't think she's gonna look too much like you, considering you short as fuck and she's tall. Serena. Yes, now I recall. The young girl sought her sister, but left without joy. That'll be her. Did she say where she was going? Westward, she wandered. Sensing her sister, she said. Guided by voices. Huh? Westward? Oh, the idiot must have gone to help me, and I was already back here! Oh. Okay, I'm curious. I was kidnapped, you see. Uh. I was in the bathhouse when some monsters attacked me. They took me off to their lair. I managed to escape. So I came back to find Serena, but it looks like now she's gone to try and rescue me. Help me out in battle, and I'll be more than willing to help you out. Right, you lot. You're no ordinary travelers. Anyone with eyes can see that. Yes, you're gonna be like, uh, you're gonna help me find my sister. You're not gonna ask, you're gonna be like, you're gonna help me find my sister. I'm expecting some demands here. Let's see. Is she gonna be a demanding little bitch? I don't have time to explain all the ins and outs of it right now, but I need you to help me go and find my sister. Are you in? You know? I'm in because I was surprised. I was expecting you to demand, not request. It's a forceful request, but it's still a request. I knew you wouldn't let me down. Are you leaving? I want to come with you. Sorry, you're staying put. But don't worry. I think I know where your dad might be. We'll find him for you. So be a good little girl till we get back. You do realize you're a little girl too, right? <laughs> I swear to God, she's got to be a dwarf. Who do you think you're talking to? Veronica, sage of Arborea and mighty magician, can keep up with riffraff like you any day. Okay, then. I'm more worried about you slowing me down, if I'm completely honest. <laughs> Bitch, please. Right. Let's head west, shall we? The monster's lair is a giant underground labyrinth out that way. Okay. I'm pretty sure we'll find Serena in there somewhere. The entrance is on the coast. I'm fine with that. Let's go. I know exactly who you are, you know. Don't let me down. Okay, can you tell me who I am? Seriously, everybody has these high expectations of the Luminary, and I'm like, what the fuck is the Luminary? It's been driving me nuts since this game officially started. All right, let's go give this guy his ring or his son's ring. Yes. Crucial ring, huh? Yep. 
every fucking time. <laughs> I know I'll play Dragon Quest if I know these jingles like the back of my hand. This is a great song, too. Um, where the hell is the other guy? Uh, I went the wrong way. All right. What I like is that you don't have a, like, energy bar. You can just straight up haul ass everywhere. Do, 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 do. Yes. Yes, thank you. I love iron arms. Yes, thank you. Incredible contest by heart. How to make iron broadswords and a cast iron claymore. Nice. So I could have made my sword. <laughs> yep. Well, if I can make a better sword than this, I could just straight up sell this one. Let's save real quick. You have, like, next to nothing for your church, dude. But you know what? Hey, you're doing your job, so... Let's accept it. Uh, yes, I intend to continue my adventure. Making good use of the map. Yeah, I know. Oh, the up and down directional buttons can help me out with that. I didn't even think to see if they use these any anyway. Um... Sparkly spots. Uh, da, 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 da. Wow, I've pretty much grabbed everywhere but two. Hold on. Oh, no, there's multiple spots. There's one there, one there. Iron ore is there, up there. Okay. Um, okay, there's there, 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 there. There's, okay, there's five unknown spots right now. Hoto step. Alright. Um, Hoto, Hoto, Hoto. Oh, I'm. What is for cryptic crypt? All right. Well, you know what? We're gonna just like. No, I don't want to do that. Um, we're gonna check out the sparkling spots real quick. Get a few fights and everything. Hoi! I will fight you all. I know she ain't gonna die, because apparently the guest characters don't even have, like, a health bar. Damn. That would have been a nice time to just blindside him at, or blindside his ass, too. Great sword guard. That way I could possibly negate an attack or two. There we go. God, that looks like it hurts. a lot of experience on this too man really all right we know the rhythm by now but it's a Garuda I don't think we fought many of them sleeper hit bongo drongo go. I'm just gonna expect- oh, don't, about to say, don't wake his ass up. Feed on the Garuda. Don't wake his ass up. That's why. 
Straight up, that's like an instant murder from on anything at that point. God help any bosses I get that on. Yo, that actually worked. Ugh. All right, heal on main character, simply because Eric's got a steady HP regen. Thank God that missed. Because guess what? Bye bye. Yo, that alone makes Eric by far almost a permanent setup, just because that is a dangerous, like, combo. Um, wow, we got a ways to go. Alright. What is the... Where's the sparkly spot? Oh. Hold on. It's right over there. Alright, well, I'll check... Oh, yeah, now I see it. Where the hell is that chest? Over there? Yo, can I actually get to that? Lava lump. Okay. Can I get to that in any way possible? Like, is there a physical way I could get down there? Oh, wait, oh, don't tell me I just screwed myself. Oh, about to say, cool. I was worried for a moment there. How the hell do I get over there? There's got to be something that lets me traverse water after a certain point. All right, lava lump. Um, one right by Hato, or Hoto. Mojo Hoto. Yeah, that was horrible. Alright, um... Let's pop up here, pop up here. What's this? A warm align? What, what the f... What the fuck is that? Okay, literally just straight up warm align. Sparkly spots. There, there, and there. We're looking for this cryptic, like, maze anyway, so we might as well just run around and do stuff. Okay, you ran into me, so... Don't, don't, don't bitch at me if you just, like, get completely spanked, slimes. Seriously, Veronica, do you not have any spells at all? Thank God she can't die, or else that probably would have put her in the red zone right there. Straight up, I love how guest characters are immortal. Who else wants some? And tag you're it. I love that. Start each fight with like 11 damage. It's pretty good preemptive. Um, yeah, let's be great sword guard. Get all up in his grill. You, sneak around behind him, sleeper hit. Aw, oh, didn't work. Come on, man. Fine, we're going to have to just beat you to death. And don't come back. Is it Mount Fuji? Or Huji? I want to say Fuji. Like Fuji, but Mount Fuji. Is this it? Because the main thing that goes through my mind is like, okay, if people are getting continuously kidnapped here. Maybe the maybe the um, bathhouse is like a means of like trying to like, hey, monster is got. Oh, what the fuck is that? Is that what? Is that where I'm going? I don't want to fight that if I don't have to. Because I don't know if that's where I'm going. I really don't. And that looked like at least a mini-boss, or an enemy that's really gonna hurt. Oh, the cryptic crypt. Yeah, it's straight up derp. I'm a fucking idiot. 
for going all this way. Plus, it might give me an opportunity to make a better claymore. I don't know, maybe I should... No, I can't really say that because Eric wouldn't be dual wielding if I gave him nothing but... If I gave him swords instead of knives. Lump wizards. Okay, I thought they were lump mages. Haha, -ha, you missed me, bitch! Yes, it worked. Great sword guard. Instantly dead. I love that. And the fact that Veronica is going to be restoring my MP for me, that is that's perfectly fine by me. Let's go over here. Work on work on my forge. See if I can make a better weapon. Wow. Think you got a big enough pile of straw there, girl? Alright. Uh no, great swords. I need three iron ore for that. Are you fucking serious? man. Ugh. I want to try to make a better greatsword, so there's not really any point. Well, actually, no. I might stand corrected there. How many do I need? How many perfectionist pearls do I need to rework something? Four? Yeah, no. No point. Unless I can make two different things, which, let me check real quick. I know, going into the menu, coming out of the menu, going into the menu, coming out of the menu. Okay, so I can make two things. Alright, let's try that. Alright, Flourish is double-edged bash. That's a pretty good fucking forager myself, if I say so myself. Eh, Iron Broadsword plus two, that's not bad. Alright. Knives. Oh, I need copper ore? Son of a bitch. Alright, can I forge any armor? No. 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 Damn it. Shit. <sighs> All right. All right, there's something way over there. And there's iron ore there. Okay, you know what? We're gonna go get that. We're gonna go get all the sparkly spots real quick. Seriously, what the hell are those things? Alright, what is this? Wake Robin. Okay, that's not bad. Alright. Chunk of iron ore. Chunk of iron ore. Chunk of copper ore. Good. Now I can try to make a better greatsword. Plus, there's some more, like, sparkly spots down here. So let's go let's see if we can get it. Alright, uh, over this way. Yo, it says I went right past it? Where the hell was it? Oh, right here, hidden behind the rock. Beast bone. Okay. 
Um, what's the other thing? Right over here, and I gotta go around that little knoll there. We're gonna go around... What is this? Handful of glass frick. Huh. Alright, well, we're gonna head out. They go make a better weapon for me finally. And campsite, yes, settle here for the night. Run over to the forge. Great sword. Are you serious? You're not fine. You're gonna play that? probably should have done is like double edge bash double edge bash and then like right at the tail end one bash one bash shit like that there now no I don't want to forge an accessory I want to rework an item cast iron claymore yes wow okay um yo I'll take that I fucked that up. I didn't mean to go that way. <sighs> well, hopefully it's at least like a plus two. There's no way in hell it's going to be a plus three since I fucked up that one part. Please be a plus two. At least be a plus two. Yes. Cool. I have no idea how much damage that does, so... Nope. Back out, back out, back out. I didn't want to do that. Thank you. And my white trophy, thank you. Raises his damage up to 68. That's nice. Alright, now we're going to sell you the crappier of my two regular swords. Put in a bag, bronze sword. Uh, yeah, crappier of that. I don't know, if I do another playthrough, I'll aim for using the boomerangs or something. Uh, sell the crappier my two leather hats. Sell my shitty divine dagger. Yeah, this is where the money comes in. Just forging random stuff and just being like, okay, I can afford to sell this, I can afford to sell this, I can afford to sell this. Yes, let's rest until dawn. Now we can continue the game. Now that I got my bet, my strong as hell, like claymore. There's got to be a reason for that door or something. All right, um, smack you. Love this music, man. Aha, missed me, bitch. Ah, I, I hate it when that doesn't work. Aha! Ah, I was hoping I would get two in a row. Would look fancy. Nice, 21 damage unpepped, that's great. Oh, you got me. Damn it. Does that still allow me to use abilities? Yes, it does. Okay, nice. Huh. 
I'm waiting to hear that do -do 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 to let me know when I leveled up. I really do like the design of the new enemies that I've never seen before. Ah. Suck, man. I thought that, like, maybe running around them would make it where you don't get hit with it, but... Oh, I love that. Oh my god, that's a straight nuke. Yeah, see, it still is going to hit. That's one of my biggest issues here. We're, about, we're already fizzled, dude. Who else wants some? All right. Miscellaneous heal all. Alright, let's go to the cryptic crypt. At the very least, the map actually tells you, yo, uh, the thing that she said you gotta go to, it's right up here. Track mages! Our first reskin and upgrade of a, of a regular enemy. Cassap. Now, okay, now that is a pretty nasty spell for that reason alone. All right, abilities, sleeper hit. Yes. You bitch. This like completely ruined my idea. Please don't wake him up. Please don't wake him up. I swear to God, Veronica, you wake his ass up. I'm gonna be so pissed. God damn it! Oh, Veronica, you are such a little bitch. That's, yeah, that's exactly how I feel when it comes to dealing with Veronica's bullshit right now. That fight would have gone so much more smoothly if Veronica didn't wake up every fucking one I put to sleep. Don't you dare wake his ass up, Veronica. Thank you. Sword guard. There we go. That's the exact reason why. Now, Persa Cutter. Get rid of him. 129 damage. That's very fucking impressive. I would very much love it if Veronica could have some fucking spells or something. Um, yeah, this is just gonna be a bit of a mess. What the hell are you? You look like a... Yeah, um... I don't think I'm allowed to say what you look like, but God, you ug me. Ugh, these things are just fucking ugly, dude. I'm just... I'm not even gonna say what the hell those things look like to me. Iron ore, nice. You popped up out of nowhere. 
Hey, the mud mannequins. Alright, didn't put her to sleep, so we're just gonna attack. Mud Mannequin! Yeah, MP Leech. Hi, Lump Wizard. Ugh. Ugh, that thing is ugly. Thank God, that's just... Ugh. Thank you, Veronica. Go right on ahead, dude. You're just gonna die next turn. Seriously, 103 the damage. Wins again. This is wow. All right, we got a Yggdrasil root. Yes, touch the Yggdrasil root. Let's get some progress. What are we witnessing today? Shades, huh? Okay. If that's all that was, then you know what? I'll say that's helpful. Yo, a trap right on up ahead in that path? That's fine. Thank you. I appreciate it. You let me know something. Oh. Okay. I see. I need to pay attention to the floors. Well, hey, at least I got an item. What the hell? Oh my god, I can mount that? Oh, yes. So doing that. Yes. Definite must. I've always wanted to ride on one of those fucking things. We are going to Greatsword Guard. Aha. Alright. You. Sleeper hit. There we go. Don't come back. 
yes. Oh, that's so fucking cool. Chunk of iron ore. Ooh. What fancy schmancy thing can this do? Oh, that is... That is just awesome. All right, pay attention to the floors. Yep. Okay. All right. Um. Is there anything else I haven't explored? I haven't gone down that way, so let's go see what's down that way. Huh. Well, we get to fight one of the dead dudes. First official, like, undead foe. I don't deem the Skull Riders as undead. I deem their steeds as undead, but I don't deem the main foe the undead. Alright, let's hit the walking corpse and try to put it asleep. Uh... Yeah, very first time being poisoned. Alright. There you go, dude. So this thing can poison you and curse you. They they definitely made this thing more lethal. Yeah, straight up. I'm just happy I'm able to ride one of these damn things. Hey, yes, a free revival. Is there anything else over here? Nope. All right. Well, we've seen all the enemies that there are to offer down here. All right, you know what? Fine. If I can't climb up the mountain, then we're going to go back that one route. I'm not getting rid of my little skeleton thing that I'm riding. I'm having too much fun. You can't make me. There we go. A feathered cap. Nice. Now, we're going to climb back up here. It's essentially an undead spider monster. All right. Go the long way around. That trap activated, that trap activated. I don't want to activate any, any more traps. Um, all right, let's see if we can tell the difference. I want to say that's a trap. I really do. No? Alright. Silver platter. Ooh, that's gotta be from, like, making the, the silver shield or something. Okay, we're gonna keep looking around. Hey, a mini metal. That is it. You want to fight? Let's fight. Alright, let's try to get this sleeper hit. Yes! Cool. Automatically, this fight's going to be easier. Alright. Great sword guard. So if it attacks him, it's not a problem. 
and wipe out. It's an immediate just pick an enemy out of the fight. What I like is they actually give you the means of a synergy like that. I'm not saying they don't give it to you in other games, it's just this one, it's more obvious it's a synergy. Cool. Oh, he learned it. Evac. Uh, I don't think I can use it on anything, but let's see. Fuck, no, I need 14 more points. Yep, mm -mm. Alright, let's get going. And head over to here. That's one heck of a fountain to be hidden away down here. Yeah. Uh -huh. Wait, over there. <laughs> Serena, wake up. Is that Serena? That's your sister. Serena! We said we'd always be there for each other to... Huh. She was just taking a fucking nap. Oh, I'm ever so sorry. It's just I... Oh, well, I was so awfully tired after all that searching that I needed a nap and... Veronica! It, is that really you? What in the world has happened to you? I, I'm just sorry, just that delay just... Oh, shit. sisters a long time you know it would take a lot more than a new look to fool me oh yes very funny what were you doing lying on the ground like that I I thought you were well that you were you know <sighs> <laughs> sorry to interrupt the reunion but didn't you tell us Serena was your kid sister Well, if you want to get technical about it, actually we're twins. But we don't look the same age anymore because, well, it's all a bit complicated. You were cursed or something like that. I, I don't know what the hell it is, but so I can see where there's a relation. I told you I was taken off by monsters, didn't I? They've been kidnapping people so they can steal their magical powers. Okay, that makes sense. Well, I wasn't going to let them have mine without putting up a fight. But the more I resisted, the younger I got. I don't quite understand it, but instead of draining my magic, they drain my age. <gasps> what I'm basically saying is that I'm not a child. So stop treating me like one. <laughs> Her staple line. Okay, we get it, we get it. You're not a kid. But you still look like one. Yeah. Don't you want to do something about it? <laughs> of course I do. Why do you think I brought you here? I want you to help me clobber those stupid monsters and see if we can fix this. Knew it. You will help us, won't you? I promise to do my bit as well. I have some really rather wonderful healing spells, you know. You don't want your spot. You want yourself a permanent spot on my team if you're the healer. If you're the healer, you're set. Ah, oh, the problem is I don't have them officially like joined. Ooh, nice. I got a thousand plus gold. Holy shit. Yeah, let's continue. Because I get the feeling we're about ready to fight a boss. Alright, what's, what's this here? Yes, touch the Yggdrasil root. That thing is really cool. I like the fact that you can ride on that. Really, is that how simple this is going to be? Umbra Kadumbra? Umbra Kadumbra. 
Umbra Kadumbra. Like, yo, could that sound any more like Abracadabra, just Umbra Kadumbra? Alright. Sorry, Skeleton Beast, but you're pretty much, you've, you've lived your usefulness. Umbra Kadumbra. Really, Umbra Kadumbra. That couldn't sound any fucking stupider. Ooh, is that a Dragon or a Jargon? Are you potty? You come here and tell Jarvis that you let that lovely, juicy specimen escape, and you think an apology's gonna cut it? Ooh, this Jars. <laughs> Do crackpots think sorcery like Veronica come along often? Do you have any idea what we'll have to do to nab a specimen like that again? Jarvis, huh? You knew I wanted to drain all her magic so I could earn the Lord of Shadows' respect <laughs> when he came back. All my plans shattered. You know, I could so mess with one of my nephews because that's the exact same name as his. I could mess with my young nephew and just be like, Yo, Jarvis, you're in the game real quick. Uh, you're not exactly the best looking creature in the game, but you're in the game. I'm not even going to throw at them like, yo, okay, they borrowed his name. No, because there's multiple different things called Jarvis. This is just a pun monster. That's them. They're the monsters who jumped me in the bathhouse and brought me here. See that jar by the big fat one? That's what he was sucking all my magic powers into. Then I guess we'd better figure out how to get them back. And we get attacked. Hmm. next video sorry to leave it on a cliffhanger before a boss fight I assume but timer just went up so if you guys enjoyed and if you're looking forward to the next video where we fight Jarvis and his crackpot crew of just whatever I'm not even gonna try a pun on this one there's, there's so many puns that have already been said <laughs> anyways Join me in the next video in order to watch the boss fight against Jarvis and his crackpot crew of shades. Anyways, until then, fare thee well and have a nice day. Bye!